We need federal legislation because right now, animal cruelty is not a federal crime. We're way past the time when we have to come to grips with this and do something about it, and it has to be done on the federal level. Everyone who owns an animal needs to know how the new laws affect them. We call it the hanging barn. It was last May. Any charges that are filed under the Commonwealth uh, Crimes Code, which that is where the, the anti-cruelty law lies, um, when those charges are filed, that goes before a magistrate. Um, if it's, the magistrates, if, if it's determined to go to court through the magistrate's office, it's a magistrate that sets the penalties. I'm still angry, and I probably always will be. So the truth is, no matter how many laws you pass, no matter how many lectures you, you give, it's not going to change till we recalibrate our muscle memory. My name is Susan Ash, and I'm the founder of Stop Animal Violence, Save, and our sole mission is to stop the abuse of the Havasupai pack animals on the Havasupai Reservation in Grand Canyon. I refuse to pay anyone and attend any place that does such terrible things to the animals that give them income. I hope you also will take this into consideration when planning a trip. Yes, yes, that's what we need, and we need a whole lot more of it. It's called responsible tourism. Don't, don't do these kinds of things without looking to see first, are these animals taken care of? Are they healthy? Do they seem reasonably happy? All you have to do is take a look at a horse's eyes and you'll have your answer.